Oh my God, guys, I'm in a very, very deep mess, a big one. I'm telling you, um, would I call this language barrier or I'm not uh, being smart? I don't know, but this is a very, very candid advice for people traveling to a place where you do not have a uh, where you, do not, where you do not speak their language. It is always good to make sure that you have a local that can guide you, put you through. Because this is putting me into mess. I'm supposed to leave here, I mean to get a boat that will take me from, uh, from uh, Paris, here at the bus station, uh, Messi bus station, that will take me straight down to uh, Zurich in Switzerland. But the, 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 the hotel where I stayed, the lady there, I asked him, I asked her, I showed her the, the, the ticket. I've already bought the ticket, which cost me over $40. So on the getting, uh, showing her the ticket, she said, oh, it's just about five or 10 minutes, uh, whatever from the hotel. I asked myself, are you sure? He said, yes. I said, let me leave around. He said, no, you can leave around even 10, whatever. I'll, I shouldn't have listened to her, honestly. Or maybe could it be that she didn't get the message as in what I was trying to say or where I was going perfectly, but I told her. So I left there, but the problem I had is getting down from one uh, train station to another, connecting to another one that will take you to another one where you will now get to this place, uh, Garbezi KM, so which is the bus station here. So that's just the problem. So I couldn't get, you know, a, a better clear view of how to move from one bus station to another. And even in the train station, when you ask people, it's very difficult for them because they do not speak English. So they, they direct you here and there. And, and instead of them to tell you that, oh, no, they don't understand. But once you show them where you are going, many of them don't really understand the map. So that is just the problem. That is just the problem. So I really don't know how. Now I have to. The bus supposed to take me by 10 a.m. and uh, to get there midnight. Now I have to pay for another uh, 40 something dollars. Oh my gosh, this is crazy, man. So and I will have to wait till 10 p.m. 10 p.m. today before the bus moves, and it's going to be night bus. So I wanted to show you guys how you can move from Paris to, uh, especially let's say from uh, Paris to Zurich or from uh, France to, you know, Switzerland. That's connecting uh, uh, to Switzerland. So that is just the problem I'm having. Honestly, this is very, very painful and uh, it's so stressful and waste of money. Tell me, am I that dumb or what? Is it, uh, am I dumb? Don't I have common sense? I don't understand. I'm beginning to feel as if I really am not smart. I don't know. I'm beginning to feel like I'm not smart or what could it be? I don't know. Please. If you know you are going to a place where uh, you don't understand their language, try to get a local that will put you through and direct you to wherever you are going. Do you understand, guys? So, please, let's keep this at the back of our mind. Let's keep it at the back of our mind and then make sure you, you know, always try to find a way to understand what they are saying. It's very important. So I don't know what we can do right now because I can't just stay here till uh, 10 p.m. We need to move around to see what and what we can do before that time. And uh, this is where you get tickets. They have about three Vlad Laka, Flixbus, Alsa. So I'm going on the uh, uh flip box that's the one i paid for that's flip box that's what i paid for and uh, it's a very big place oh wow this is another one okay this is black black car uh i don't know how well let me see if there's a way oh people are trying that you are getting into that one let me see where i can So that's the customer care. 
And that's where you obtain your ticket. That's where I obtained my ticket as well. Okay, you see, it's information uh, through ticket. So you get, if you have any complaint or you want to ask about anything, so that's where you go to. It's 10 p.m. I don't know. But I, actually, I need to get a SIM card, guys. I need to get a SIM card. Yeah, and that's the first mistake I made. I need to get a SIM card that uh, I can use in connecting and moving around because where I am right now I can't get a free internet I don't know why I can't get a free Wi-Fi so this is the outer part of uh, the the bus station I came in through that side I came out from uh, the train station so the train station the subway is down there so I came out from there and I have to walk down to this place so this is uh, the the bus station so we have about three we have three blah blah car alsa and uh, flix uh, bus i don't know if they have more than that but it's only three that i can i could see there so so that's where we are so guys um just keep watching and let's see how it goes this adventure is becoming more crazier i'm telling you so if you want to come to europe you need to have enough money if not guy <laughs> you will just forget yourself here. Yo. <laughs> I'm telling you. And I think uh, it's not just about a language barrier. Uh, but it has to do with me believing so much that uh, uh, whosoever I ask any question or direction from really knows what they are telling me. Yeah, I, I, I think everything still goes back to language barrier or could it be that, you know, sometimes even where they, we are, even where I come from, where the, we speak the same language, some people don't know direction of a place. Instead of them to tell you that they don't know, they will just say, go straight. And when you get there, you will discover that that's not the place. You have to come back to another place. Seriously, uh, this is so, this is so sad, so sad, so sad, so sad, it's too sad, because I'm just pondering over everything, looking at what could have caused all this mess that I'm into, so that's exactly what I'm just looking at. Now I need to get a SIM card, I don't know where to go to here, I've asked many people, where can I, is there any closer store here, is there any store that is closer that I can get a, a SIM card, at least I need to make use of uh, that so that I can communicate with uh, the people that I will be going to meet at uh, uh, the other place that I'm going to before it's too late. But right now, I'm getting there said 7 p.m. tomorrow wow I'm getting to my next destination 7 p.m. and we will leave here 10 p.m. and this one is a direct bus just 10 minutes past 12 so what will happen is this I think uh, I need to go around and ask around to see if I can uh, locate a place where I can just get any SIM card for like 10 euro or whatever that I can use enough data to communicate I can you know connect to the hotspot and communicate you know with people I think that's what I will do because right now Nobody can reach me. I'm out of the hotel where I use the hotel Wi-Fi. And I'm lost here. I'm alone here. What could have caused all this? You know, sometimes when things happen, you just try to 
think why I'm not a, I'm not a dull person I'm a very smart guy why am I getting into all this this shouldn't be me because I'm always time conscious and I always want to get to anywhere I'm going to on time I get there before the time so what is it yeah another issue like I said everything still has to go back to language barrier honestly it's still language barrier because number one I am not used to you know connecting from one uh, train station to another from one M14 M10 M9 M6 M3 all those stuff and uh, when you still when you ask them you know it's, yeah it's, it's, it's possible you don't know how to connect it because we are not used to it we don't have such that in our place there that's in Nigeria so right now if you don't know then you ask people and the issue is when you ask them many of them about 80 something percent do not understand English so they just uh, blah, 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 once, and I, when you show them where you are going they just keep on trying to direct you to wherever they think that uh, it should be and when you get there again you find yourself missing and you have to ask again so you keep on asking 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 and that's take over the time so maybe if you are here and uh, you want to connect you have an appointment somewhere i think the best thing for you is to leave even four hours before that appointment that's if you are new and you don't know how to move around just four hours maybe within uh, you can use two hours if you are lost two hours or three hours but definitely you will get up to the place on time or before yeah yeah. Uh, yeah i i i I, the, the, I guess the lady at the hotel was looking at it as if i'm an indigen here and that i would definitely know how to find my way from one it was just saying okay from here to here just to take it it's five minutes walking and yeah truly but getting all those informations were very tough uh, guys anyway it is what it is